All right, and I'm back from a lunch break. We didn't go anywhere yet. I will. I'm going to record maybe the first couple of rounds of the arena. I'm also going to do something kind of cheesy to help me along the road. I'm going to downgrade the difficulty real quick. <clears throat> Casual. Oh, there's a whole narrative. Wow. We'll do casual. Ugh. I like that. You know, this. DLC advertised that it has a more or less robust customization for the apartment, but I don't think there's a lot that much to do with it. We're happy to fulfill all your household needs. I could be wrong, but we're going to go straight for the arena. That's the arcade. You know, whoops, I, I went past it. It has been a while. Oh, here's some high scores. Uh, Aria. Tali Jordan. Algiani plays. <laughs> Bailey plays. Barla Vaughn somehow. Bray is Arya's second in command, I think. <clears throat> no. I'm good. Hello, Commander Shepard. Welcome to the Armax Arsenal Arena. Thank you. Armax Arsenal and the Citadel Tourist and Visitor Board have registered you for a complimentary competitor's pass. You may start a match by going downstairs and selecting simulator options. When you are ready, enter the locker room. All right, here's what I typically do. <clears throat> I, it might not let me do anything quite yet. Okay, there we go. The Level. Soon. Good luck to the Just do random. Enemy. I'll do service for now. Challenge. Yeah, I can't do anything about that right now. Oh, I can't. Oh. These right here, I usually get... No meta gel and no ammo. Enjoy the show. Yeah. So those two I usually do, and that's a good boost to the score. <clears throat> and you can even buy teammates. Rex and Grunt are the two that I always take. But for now, we'll do Ashley and James. Six thousand plus is gold prize, but when I get to a certain configuration, I can do. Well, I can do like nine thousand plus per game, but I I need to unlock collectors. I need to unlock those score things. We're gonna give him the typhoon. Because weight and weight and uh, stability mean nothing to them, so just pop that damage on there and I guess give them accuracy. Alrighty. <coughs> 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 
<coughs> Excuse me. Oh good, I can't do this. Cause yeah, actually I haven't touched. Definitely gonna give her some damage. Oh, I'm gonna make her do the campaigns or the Eh. I don't know what mine There we go. It's all right for damage. The soldier's a fun class, but it's it turns the game into a generic shooter. And I find it a little bit boring, to be honest. Hmm. Yeah, have him power up everybody else. Carnage, that's his bread and butter attack, so I'll do that. For me, I didn't realize I didn't max incinerate. There we go. Alright. <coughs> Make sure they both have their typhoons. Oh god. Well, I'm not really under much threat right now. Oh, God. Oh, I didn't get the... Oh, yeah, I did get it. Okay, cool. <clears throat> oh, this is a good, great vantage point. God, I need my Black Widow. The match is over. There we go. Not bad to start, but... <clears throat> okay, I got silver. This match brought to you by the Citadel Department of Tourism. Experience <clears throat> being made. That's all there is to it. Here's what I need to do to boost my score. I need to get Rex and Grunt and maybe more maps. But first I'm going to I'll just go ahead and get these. <clears throat> No ammo. Why can't I? 
Oh, there we go. I gotta do it one more time. Oh, there. For another silver. And it, as you keep playing, you get like challenges to do. Um, I don't really mess around with them. I think they send you credits and stuff if you do them, which is fine. But I'm not going to do them right now. I'm just going to go. I'll do one more round and end the video and probably do a lot of off-screen grinding. Because <clears throat> this is fun, but there's only so much you can watch, you know? Do they have any ammo types? Yeah, they're active. Okay, good. It is fun to play soldier and then play with incendiary ammo and just watch any of your enemies and you fucking melt. It's great. But I find the gameplay to be too boring and I don't think it's... It doesn't, like, give respect to the game itself. But it can be fun, but it's it turns an already not difficult game into super easy mode. And I play on normal, even. I'm not right now just for the sake of the scoring system. The enemies die quicker, but the score itself is not affected at all. It's always the same values all around. So you could play this on narrative and still get the same kind of points. I completely forgot narrative was even a difficulty. <laughs> oh god, they're right here. Ah, uh, this would be good. And it gets more complex. I think I will eventually record me doing some high level, like, see I only got like 400 extra points for that. <clears throat> I'll do the elite enemies, I'll do my 9,000 point games on recording, but not right now. I still have to do a few games to get towards that. Kinda gotta work my way up. I gotta get some challenges. I gotta get elite enemies. I gotta... I gotta unlock the collectors. Nobody gel. And the money maker here is when I can make gold rounds on every single... Oh, it's not gonna show it. Well, either way, I, I, when I do gold rounds on every single match, I can get 10,000 with credits with a gold prize. And I'm just short of my... Oh, it doesn't show you when, it, when you don't have the coin to maximize it, but you get 10,000 for gold, I think 6,000 for silver, and 3,000 credits for a bronze. Or maybe 2,000 for a bronze, because that would make sense for that... Uh, anyway, you get the idea, but uh, thanks for joining me. I'm going to go ahead and do some of my own off-screen stuff. And now I'm getting 20% more score. So, yeah. I'm going to go do some off-screen stuff. Have fun. Jo join me later. Toodles.